Hey guys, it's Pets for Life here with part 4 of the Hermit Crab Care video. And now we're going to talk about shells. So, the main thing you want to know about their shells is that they will change their shells just for fun and not just because they grow. And um, they will do that if they find a shell that's more comfortable for them or has a better texture or feel. Um, so these types of shells are very uncomfortable for hermit crabs. It throws off their balance and, you know, when they try to hide, it'll just cover this part of their body and it won't really... Um, it won't really cover their whole body and if they want to walk through like a coconut or something they're gonna to have to walk to the side like this and not like forwards like they want to. My hermit crabs prefer and love these types of shells where it has that nice little curl to the right and um, it's very even for them so when they hide and their body is right here so when they hide they go like this and it just covers their whole body. Um, so these types of shells are also okay as long as it doesn't have that little long tip, it'll be fine. Um, this shell looks very similar to these ones. It's for an older hermit crab. Um, I like it because it's nice and glossy on the inside. It has a good texture and feel, so that the hermit crab abdomen will feel more comfortable there. Um, the hermit crab abdomen, unlike the rest of their body, is very soft and um, it's very squishy. So they would like something like that where it's easily for them to slip into it and it won't give them a hard time. This one, again, is for an older hermit crab. It has the same little curl to the right like those other ones. Um, main thing you want to know about their shells is you never, ever want to get painted shells. Never. Those shells will chip off um, into their food or into their water bowl, and if they eat it or if they pick it off another hermit crab, it will poison them, and their, the paint can be toxic, and, you know, it'll make them very sick, and they will eventually die. So always get natural shells. And I like the look better just because, you know, it seems better in the environment. I don't like the harsh, um, bright colors. So, yeah, my hermit crabs do not have that. Another good thing that you want to make sure is that you always have a lot of shells in the tank. I like to have two per hermit crab, one that's their current size and one that's going to be a bit bigger for them. Um, so this shell, as you can see, it has that nice glossy pearl-like insulation in there. And that thing is called Mother of Pearl. And hermit crabs uh, will choose shells that have that because it, it has a natural insulation. It also is very smooth and glossy, so when they slide in, it's really comfortable for them. This one, again, has that glossy little feel to it. I mean, these ones don't, um, but they are still pretty smooth, um, but, you know, they won't have that natural insulation that we're looking for. Um, another thing that you want to make sure you have is um, a good variety. So you do want to provide them with these kind, just in case if they do want to try it and see if they like it. Um, so yeah, that's basically all you need to know about hermit crabs and their shells and what you need for them.